Welcome to Snaptix How to Convert from Solid Part to STL. In this tutorial, I'll be running you through how to download Solid Part files from our website and convert them to STL files. This tutorial is specifically to show users one option to download, make edits, and export STL files for print. Another option is to go through the open source Tinkercad. Now, for a bit of background definition. A solid part file is a file format used to save 3D part models in SOLIDWORKS, which is a professional 3D CAD software. An STL file is a 3D object file, which is a file format supported by many other software packages. It is widely used for rapid prototyping, 3D printing, and computer-aided manufacturing. This is why it's very important to convert from solid part to STL, since most 3D slicers do not natively support the import of solid parts directly. First, you should go to the snaptix.org website and in the top right hand corner click on hardware. This is what the home page looks like. So you go to the right hand corner and click on hardware. You will note that we have these downloads separated into modules. So you can choose a module that you want and go to the downloads column and click the SOLIDWORKS CAD download. For this tutorial, I'll be working with the stretch module. So I press the SOLIDWORKS CAD download. This takes you to our box folder, which contains multiple files. You will see all the related and most updated STL and solid part files for the module you have selected, as well as the PDF version of the TAPR license Snaptix is under. Select the part that you are interested in modifying and click download. So we're interested in modifying the module. So we'll click that and we'll press a download. You can choose wherever you want to download your module to. I am going to download it to my desktop, so I press save. So once it's downloaded, you, you can open it in your 3D software, in this case SOLIDWORKS. It is important to note that other 3D modulars won't natively import these files in the same way as SOLIDWORKS. In this moment, once you have your 3D part open in SOLIDWORKS, this is the time for you to make any designs that design changes that you wish to make. If you wish to know the basics of editing a 3D part, please watch our beginner video about that on our website. Once satisfied with your part, go to File, Save As, and under File Name where it says Save As Type, choose STL, and then press Save. For SOLIDWORKS specifically, there will be a box that shows up, press yes, and now you have successfully converted from solid part to STL. Hope this tutorial was very useful and thank you for sticking around and watching.